them all charred up. These little checks here is what I'm looking for when I'm charring it. I want to see those just form. Another thing you might notice is uh, when I pass the flame over it, after a while, once it develops these checks and gets a, a little shine or sheen to it, when you pass the, the flame over it, it doesn't, you don't get the burst of yellow flame. It, it doesn't want to reignite, and that's how I know I've charted enough. Now, there's still a few little spots here burning. We'll go over that next with a wire brush, and that'll put all that out. It'll knock the sauce, make it a nice uniform black color. The, uh, show you what I mean. And we always brush it with the grain. And we got about, I'd say, three millimeters of uh, char on the outside. And what's underneath that is now hardened wood. It'll take a lot to get moisture to go back into it. Insects don't want to eat it. Fungus can't grow on it. And that's how we get this wood to be preserved as a fence post. And I didn't have to do the whole thing. Just what's going to be right at soil level or below would have sufficed but I actually want these posts to be black and after they've weathered in the rain a little bit they'll turn a silvery gray color and I think that'll just look nice uh, as far as these gate posts go yeah where we got fire we can just scrub over it with the wire brush and now put it right out and get rid of the char at the same time Additionally, you can coat these in oil, and I might I have a bunch of uh, used deep fry oil that uh, will give this a little bit of a shine. I don't know how much that will do for preserving it since, uh, well, it's just a vegetable oil, but it might be worth a try. Oily woods like cedar, rosiny woods like pine tend to last a lot longer before they rot simply because of that. I don't know if peanut oil have much effect or not. But I may give that a try. We'll see. It's an extra step, but I think the charring alone will be enough to do the trick. So, that's that. Get back with you when it comes to the next step.